I love using and finding vintage cookware, tableware, flatware, dishes, glasses, all that good stuff. And in this video, I'm gonna show you my little collection, how I love to set a really bright table, and kind of talk to you about how I came about these pieces. Welcome to the Dress Up Mom. Thank you so much for tuning in. I really appreciate it. If you are a regular viewer and subscriber, I absolutely adore you. Thank you so much. If you are new to the channel, you like what you're seeing, please subscribe. It's just the button. I am trying to grow this channel. We are also on all the social media outlets, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, at The Dress Up Mom, hashtag The Dress Up Mom. You can check us out there as well. I love to have a really colorful kitchen, a colorful table, and it's a, it's a place that I like to show a little bit of creativity. So recently I fell in love with Fiesta Wear and Pyrex. I like the older Fiesta Wear because I can buy it resale and find some really nice pieces that isn't as expensive. And then the vintage Pyrex is just so cool. And I have found some really neat pieces lately. You can see here, these are my kitchen cupboards. They're full of a lot of color. I'll show you sort of what I have. And then this is how I love to set a really colorful table. And all of the pieces that I'm using here are resale, vintage, or gently used and it makes me feel really good. I got them for a great price. I'm reusing stuff and I really think this older stuff is just so much better made. It lasts longer. It has a little bit of character and I absolutely love it. It makes me feel really good and I like to cook and I like to have people over and I think it looks really fun to have a colorful vintage table. Let me take you into my kitchen and I'll just talk a little bit more about this. Welcome to my kitchen. Here I am with my wonderful vintage and resale finds. As I mentioned, I'm obsessed with this Fiesta wear and I was really lucky to score 12 of each of these at various places, consignment classics, thrift shops, but I got 12 of these bowls, all different colors, which is what I wanted. I wanted like a whole rainbow of colors. So I have, I'll open this up so you can kind of see in the back as I'm doing it, but I have 12 of these. I found 12 of the little plates, 12 of the soup bowls. Like I said, mostly I got these at Consignment Classics in San Diego. And then my Pyrex, which I absolutely love. Look at this vintage Pyrex. It's so cool because of the colors are incredible. And then the little tops come off of it so you can store your food in the refrigerator with those as well as put them in the microwave. They're just lovely and I just love the colors. The other Pyrex piece that I bought at Bad Madge, all of the Pyrex by the way is from Bad Madge in South Park here. She has a picker, Emily Twirls, who finds this amazing vintage Pyrex. So she's got a great collection of it. You can also get it in on her Instagram feed. Look at this, it has a space for two dishes. So two veggies, if you want something that's like vegan or not vegan or whatever, but I think that's really cool. And then this is just another piece of Fiesta Ware that I found resale also at Consignment Classics in great condition. And I use this one a lot for serving. Now, moving over to the glassware. I found these really pretty painted glasses when I was cleaning out my mom and dad's place. I never saw them use them, but I love them. They're about five or six of them that are in varying colors like this. And then also at Consignment Classics, I redid all of our wine glasses. So I've got like a champagne, a white wine, and a red wine that are really lovely. And these go in the dishwasher too. I got vintage napkins from Bad Match that are kind of French and this gold color that goes with everything else. And then finally, my flatware, I also picked up resale. And this I really looked for because I wanted something that was both gold and silver. I think these are just so lovely. They have a little bit of the stainless steel and then also a little bit of this gold uh, trim on the outside of them. 
they are also able to go into the dishwasher and I found 12 it was this big set I think it cost like less than $50 and it was a big set of, with 12 of everything here 12 of the big spoons knives forks these tiny little forks the tiny little spoons and even this really fun soup and gravy ladle all of that came in and again, the price of all of this stuff was amazing. I think the glasses were like a dollar each. The Pyrex, a little bit more expensive, but still not too bad. And then I picked up these Fiesta plates and the Fiesta wear, you know, probably like a dollar for each piece or a little bit less than that. So that was another big bonus, but I mostly got it because I really loved all of that. Finally, in my kitchen, the other thing that I love, this is not vintage, but I had it on my list for a long time. It is vintage inspired, is this Smeg toaster, which just like, makes the best toast, but look at the color of it. It's so great. I love the design of it. So yeah, that is my vintage inspired kitchenware. I love it and i would love to know if you use any of these kinds of pieces either pyrex or fiesta wear or get your things resale leave that in the comments below thank you so much for tuning in i really appreciate it until next time have fun and dress it up a little